Hi there. Just going to have a sip of my smoothie. If you're wondering what's in this, it's kale, pineapple, wild apples, and um, banana. So, you know, I, I don't know. I sometimes find it weird that um, I will, will go on YouTube and tell people or try to encourage people to eat more fruits and vegetables. It's, it's like stating the obvious and, um, and it seems weird. Like it's, you know, okay, hold it. This is a no brainer. Eat more fruits and vegetables, right? And yet, if you look around at what people are eating, and if you look in the grocery stores of what is being sold as food, it's far more complicated. And we've done a lot of damage through what we've eaten. And you know, fruits and vegetables, I can say honestly, have in, 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 on some level have saved my it saved my life. Um, I know it sounds fanatical, it sounds crazy, but it's true. Uh, I mean, I when I think of how I treated my body over the years. I'm amazed I'm still around, to be quite honest with you. Like, I, I would say I really didn't get connected, connected with eat, eating healthy until around 2006. And, you know, that, I guess that was my, I was in my late 40s then, and, uh, or mid 40s. So what did I eat prior to that? I ate a lot of meat. I ate a lot of cheese. I ate fruit. I ate fruits as well. I always, I've always loved fruits, but everything else I was doing to myself was bad. Uh, drank too much wine, and uh, I guess earlier, like in my twenties, I drank a lot of beer, um, and. For years, I used to eat a big bag of Ruffles barbecued rippled chips. And for a while there, I was eating those chips with a big tub of sour cream dip on top of having a couple of beers. And, you know, yeah, I mean, like I said, I'm amazed that I'm still here today. <laughs> uh, when I think of the things I've done, not, not to mention also I smoked for about 12 years. I started smoking full time when I was um, in my early 30s, gave it up in my 40s. Uh, and oh, I haven't mentioned the, the, the 70s. It was like heavy partying, substance abuse. You know, I don't need to go into detail here, but so I've been around the block, let's just say. And I've done a lot of bad things to my body along, along the way. A lot of it was just ignorance. Um, you know, when you're younger, you feel invincible. I, I could eat, I mean, there, were, there was a time when, if I, as long as I was physical, physically active, I could eat, it seemed like I could eat whatever I wanted and still be in pretty good shape. Um, that gig doesn't work though when you're my, when you're now like I'm now in my 50s my early 50s I'm going to be 53 in November and it doesn't work like that anymore if I was eating the way I was back then all the exercising in the world would make no difference um, so am I in perfect health now since I've been eating my fruits and vegetables no I'm not in fact, I've done, I would say, permanent damage from all the years of abuse. And some things may never be repaired. Um, like, for example, I wear glasses. My eyesight is poor. Uh, my teeth, you know, 
they're in terrible shape and it, had, it has nothing to do with all the fruit I've been eating. It's to do with the coffee that I drank throughout the years, the wine I drank, uh, the smoking, the acidic foods like meat and cheese. That is what contributed to my tooth decay and uh, I've had a lot of work on my teeth and I'm still going to need more work on my teeth. But I could tell you since I have been eating fruits and vegetables, the, the tooth decay is pretty much come, well, slowed down considerably, and I would say almost come to a halt, but the damage is done. I really made a mess of my teeth. Um, there's probably, I would say, still areas internally deep inside of me that needs to be rejuvenated and uh, cleansed, um, detoxified. I'm sure there's areas that I haven't even touched yet, and, and so, you know, it's it's something that I would like to explore deeper um, and I've actually started with uh, doing short water fast and I find that to be quite beneficial and I, I would like to work that up to doing a longer water fast but you know not you you don't need to do water fast all the time but if you did it once or twice a year I think it, it's good for the body it just kind of flushes stuff out and then you know there's environmental pollutants as well. Uh, I live in the city and you know I go out running daily and some days the air is terrible and so I'm taking in these talk and toxins, I'm inhaling them, uh, they're going into the pores of my skin. It's so I'm being still, even though I, I'm eating healthy, um, there's environmental toxins that I'm exposed to constantly. So no, I am not in perfect health. I don't know if I ever will reach that level of perfect health. I don't know. But regardless of that, just by eating a diet of predominantly fruits and vegetables, um, what I do experience is exceptional health. And um, so, Although that alone, eat, just eating a lot of fruits and vegetables is not the complete picture, it definitely helps in regaining your health again. So as simple as it seems, it works. So eat your fruits and vegetables, that's all I can say, I know. it. Um, eat them, eat lots of them. Uh, have a nice day and God bless.